Sally Caitlin. We're talking about culture and history, as always, here at the Neville Public Museum. Got to say, they have a wide variety of exhibits currently on display. Another eye-opening one here. This is actually highlighting some of the local artwork by done by some local artists here in Northeast Wisconsin. We're actually joined alongside Kevin here. He's one of the curators here at the museum. Kevin, thanks so much for having us out this morning. My pleasure. Good morning, Calvin. Good morning. So tell us a little bit about this exhibit that we're currently standing in. I gotta say, this this piece right here, this is <laughs> this is pretty uh, yes. eccentric. Yeah, <laughs> unique, right? Art Gone Viral is the name of this exhibit uh, by the Green Bay Art Colony. So the Green Bay Art Colony are a collaborative group of women artists from Northeast Wisconsin. And this is actually the 106th exhibition of the Green Bay Art Colony. It started as a club. It formed actually the Neville Public Museum. So ever since we've had a collaboration with them. So each year, new artists, new works show up. So the art gone viral is a play on the pandemic. And so all these artists in their homes, in their studios are working on inspiration drawn from being sheltered uh, in place and producing this work. So this is called Change Happens by Sandy Melroy. So we have a whole variety of media from textile to ceramic to paintings, uh, sculpture work. So it's just a wonderful exhibition of over 30 pieces of artwork by 25 artists. That's fantastic. And yeah, I mean, it, it goes well beyond just this. But uh, I mean, if we just take a look around here, just around the room, um, these are all done locally, pretty much, as you mentioned, like throughout, throughout the pandemic. Uh, but they've also been awarded as well, correct? Correct, yeah, so it's a juried exhibition. The juror this year uh, was Elizabeth Meisner Gigstead out of uh, the Miller Art Museum in Sturgeon Bay. And so she selected uh, these works out of a body of work uh, that was submitted, and then the top three were chosen. So we, you can see the ribbon awards for those that actually won awards. And it's a really then it shows that it's kind of a, a curated choice award for the best work that's available to these artists and, and to our audience here at the Neville. Fantastic. Really cool stuff, Kevin. Thank you again so much for having us out this morning. My pleasure. So this exhibit here, this will be on display until about mid-March. Plenty of fascinating artifacts, I have to say. My favorite would probably be an angel statue right over that way. I don't think you guys got a shot of it, but maybe we'll come back to it later on in the morning. Still plenty of time to come on down and check it out. We'll swing it on back to you guys for now over in the studio. All right, thank you, Calvin. It's really cool because you can learn things about the history and yep. see some really cool art. I yes. love that. I love that petticoat that she has on there. It's Very beautiful. Cool. Thanks, Calvin. <laughs>